Robbie, what's going on, man? Welcome back, deal of the week. Uh, what's up, Seth? You got a uh, nice looking building here, 29 Willow Street. Why don't you tell people why they should buy it and maybe why they should not buy it? Yeah, this is a good one. Hopefully uh, some redemption on deal of the week because clearly I didn't do a good enough job selling 276 Smith Street, which is still out there, by the way. Can get it done in the low twos, almost a seven cap in place with upside. So, but let's dig into 29 Willow. 29 Willow, let's go. So um, most importantly, this is premier Brooklyn Heights real estate. If you're not familiar, there's on average about 11 investment sales properties that sell per year in Brooklyn Heights. That's it. This is ridiculously rare. And the building itself has windows around the entire thing. Will forever have windows around the entire thing. It's a landmark block. It's basically a corner. It's almost 10,000 square feet. Just a ridiculously rare building uh, block off the promenade. Um, wow. Something else to note. I just sold 132 Montague Street, which is a shell for four and a half million dollars in a worse location. And it's going to cost you. They're going to be all in for about nine million dollars to rebuild the building over there in a worse location for a smaller building. So you can buy this one for the same price for a bigger building in a better location. Yeah. So this is nine to ten. Why are so many? Yeah. Units so she was she had furnished rentals. She's going to be delivering everything vacant. Why would you not buy this building? Before we go into other reasons why you would buy it, um, first off, she's got fifteen boxes of paperwork. So if you don't want to di get your hands dirty and dig into fifteen boxes of paperwork to figure out how this was destabilized, this deal probably isn't for you. Other reason is if you. Um, are if you don't care much about risk adjusted returns and you're just focusing on the highest yield you could possibly buy this deal also might not be for you but this is as good of a location as you can get that's i mean it's better than i'd rather have 15 boxes than zero because if you've got 15 Absolutely. boxes you put together a story as to why all these units are free market and they're going to be delivered for sure so you could figure i'd out. love to see a tenant try to challenge the paperwork on this building because you just go into court, uh, drop 15 boxes of paperwork. It's it would uh it's gonna take forever to go through, but we have first free market leases for and last rent stabilized leases. So this is okay. as good as it gets. Okay, nice man. Someone will buy it. Look, the, the location, the address looks unbelievable. It looks like a squeaky clean building. Um nice job. I'm sure someone will buy this thing. 